was perfect. Every scene, and it, and that's what it took because it was a really hard movie to shoot, uh, and it was sweaty and, and and long days, and it was hot, and it was. Uh, way more physical than I had anticipated. So just like, you know, having a partner who was you know, pushing up against a wall with me or just down to do whatever and run and jump and sweat and cry, it was uh, it was nice to have somebody. Annie is a ride or die chick, y'all. Let me just take it back. Yeah, she don't go through it with you. Yeah, no, <laughs> she don't fight for her love, okay? What about you? Do you have a favorite scene? Um, I think, well, the lucky thing about this film was we were able to shoot it somewhat consecutive. So, it, or in order, and that's never really the case when you're doing anything TV or film. And so we started as people that didn't know each other, and then we were handcuffed together and literally became best friends, and then became... Uh, oh, oh, is this, a, is this a little bit of information? Yeah, so, and then we became uh, deeper than that. And so, exclusive, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, so, hello. Uh, it was really, it was really fun. This <laughs> deal. So I go, tell all my best friends out. Um, so we, you really kind of got to watch um, this like relationship genuinely, authentically unfold into something that was some somewhat kismet, like kismet and super soul lady, and we had our. Our, our partner in crime too, yeah, just kind of get it, and you know, and everybody else, like, you know, the producers, and um, I don't know if everybody knew, but <laughs> Mark said, if you don't know, now you know. But yeah, I guess no, this kind of came to gradually, like, uh, spark my attention in terms of what we were investigating and having as this newfound friendship and the relationship. I love it. Okay, Manny, Manny Healy, Manny. Hey, Manny. Come on, y'all. Let's give a round of applause for Manny Healy. Can I ask Manny, what drew you to this project? Come on, get your love. Uh, what drew you to this project? First of all, let me um, bring up my team, um, Yolanda. Yes. yes. Right. Come on, everybody. Get your love. And um, this is what happened. So, our guy, Bill Baker. Come over here, Bill Baker. Bill. This way, Bill. Bill, um, he worked for us on our our project called True to Game 2. Yes. He was a line producer and um, we built a relationship. So he kept telling us like, hey, I'm gonna take you to dinner. I wanna treat you to dinner. I wanna treat you to dinner. And then, you know, like six months after, I said, you know what? Let's go to dinner. And then he explained <laughs> He said, I got a script. It's different. It's different than what you did before. And I wanna present it to you. It's so something you want to purchase. So of course, I don't like to read scripts right off the back, so I sent it to Yolanda and the team. When you read it, they said the shit is fucking fire. Yes. So I said, okay, cool, let me read it. And then um, I decided to read it. And um, from there on, we just decided that we're gonna make the, we're gonna green light it and, um, and shoot the film. So what happened was we, Bill had a director that we should hire that was a DP on the Saw franchise. And he wasn't working out with us creatively. So we asked Bill, and then we had a DP that we like, and he introduced me to Mark. And Mark came and blew us away when he came to my house. He like, just such a great guy. And I was like, you know, like, Mark is a great guy. So we got Mark, and then we started putting all the pieces together with the lead and, and Charlie. Charlie wasn't talking to me. I was trying to get him on the phone after I hired him, but they're like, he's in Atlanta. He's doing another movie. He don't talk in the middle of a movie like, but I hired him. And then Charlie came out, and they all murdered. But um, Bill brought it to our attention. And us and the team right here, we all put it together. You guys did a fantastic job. Round of applause for everybody. You guys are so good. Can, can, can I ask? Can I ask you guys? Will there be a part two? Because she needs to get some. Listen, ask Annie that. Ask Annie that her. question. Annie. Uh, Annie. Yes. Uh oh. Part two. Yeah. 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 And only with the same, like, only with the same crew. I'm yeah. Like, yeah. Come on yeah. now. Chemistry. Yeah. Yeah. That's so Hollywood. Nice. I love it. And then maybe Charlie can have a twin brother that wants vengeance or something. You know what I'm saying? He may not be dead. I don't think he didn't die. He just like knocked out for a second. He, he's coming back. Okay, well then there we go. We have an exclusive. You want to say something? Yeah. I just, you know, Manny gave shout out to, um, to all of us. We're, you know, his immediate team. But I just want to say thank you to um, the production designer, the costume, okay. hair, makeup, wardrobe. Where's Jordan? Where's that? Oh, the sound coordinator, where's Bobby Jones? The sound guy, the suspense. Come on, they did all right. He did all the designs for us. We built.
build the wall, to shake the wall. We did everything. We build up. And he said, or Charlie said, in one location, um, two. two in the same year, two. We did a house, sorry about that. We did it at the house, but it was like a four weeks in one location. They already built the shit out of it. I gotta give him a round of applause. And wait a minute, and the girl that was hanging upside down came in. Where's she at? Kayla. Let me tell you. Kayla. Oh, she's not here. No, 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 but let me tell you, her audition was upside down. <laughs> 